Welcome to Football Navigator as we take a look at one of the most famous and richest South African football player ever, Benny McCarthy's lifestyle in 2021. But before we resume, please take your time to like this video as well as sharing it across all soccer fanatics. The South African superstar was born on the 12th of November 1977 and as of 2021, he is 44 years old. Benedict Sol McCarthy was a notable South African football player before he left off and he currently serves as a coach in his home country, South Africa. Born in Cape Town, McCarthy was raised in Hanover Park in one of the Cape Flats. That is an area known for its notoriety due to the high rate of unemployment and gang violence. His older brother is Jerome McCarthy and he was also a South African professional football player who played for Kaiser Chiefs as well as Manning Rangers. In the year 2000, Benny McCarthy got married to his wife Maria Santos who is from Spain. Afterwards, their marriage was blessed with three daughters who are Allegra, Maya and Mina before the two got divorced. One of the reasons for the divorce Benny McCarthy said she did not want to leave Spain and it became a problem. He further said that Spanish people are not good travelers and they never want to leave Spain. Even the players leave for one season and they want to go back home. After the two separated in 2007, McCarthy got married to another woman. The name is Stacy Moron, a Scottish model and together they are also blessed with a daughter called Lima Rose. Apart from all this, Ben McCarthy's cars are also in a class of the latest automobiles in town. According to Supersport, Benny McCarthy owns a number of cars in England as well as in South Africa. Benny McCarthy has been seen shrinking around a Porsche Panamera, Audi Q7, Range Rover and Bentley. The car reported he is driving in South Africa is a Porsche Panamera. The all-time South African top goal scorer, without doubt, has enjoyed much affluence since the beginning of his career. At the moment, as published on Celebrity Network, Benny McCarthy's worth is about $16 million, which is a whooping 240 million rands. As a highly successful professional football player, McCarthy has gotten himself lots of priceless assets over the years and in some of the best places across the globe. Amongst them, Ben McCarthy owns a house in England, Scotland as well as his home country in South Africa. In fact, his home in Cape Town was lavished with multi-million rents. It is just a heaven that anyone would dream to live in. In 1995, Ben McCarthy, aged just 17, is given his debut by Gavin Hunt at second division side Seven Stars. In 1997, he scored twice away to Kaiser Chiefs while on loan at Cape Town Spurs. McCarthy also became the top scorer at an African Youth Championship and is player of the tournament. He then joins Ajax Amsterdam for a South African record fee and makes his Bafana Bafana debut against Netherlands to play in the World Youth Cup Finals. In 1999, McCarthy won the Dutch Cup as well as joining Celta Vigo in Spain. In 2002, McCarthy played in the AFCON and scored 12 goals in 10 stars on loan at FC Porto in Portugal. He became the first South African football player to score two goals in two different World Cups. The player was eventually signed in 2003 by FC Porto. In 2004, McCarthy became the first South African player to win a UEFA Champions League winner's medal, coming on as a substitute as FC Porto beat AS Monaco 3-0 in the final. 
also winning the Portuguese League and the Super League under the guidance of Jose Mourinho. In 2005, he played in Porto's win when they win the Portuguese Super Cup and also played in 2006 for the AFCON for Bafana Bafana. He also won the same year the Portuguese League and the Cup with Porto and also joined Blackburn Rovers in England. In 2007, Benny McCarthy was the second top scorer in the Premiership with 18 goals. In 2008 is where McCarthy scored his 31st goal for South Africa, making him Bafana Bafana's all-time top goal scorer. In 2010, McCarthy signed for West Ham United. The following year, McCarthy then joined Orlando Pirates to win the Telecom Knockout. The following year, McCarthy helped Pirates to complete their second successive triple and he retired the following year in 2013.